Okay, I'm back. I tried to make this at the end of the last video, but it didn't work. Um, went to my parts place. I got a new battery. Make sure you take this off the puzzle, off the cap. We have these felt pieces and dielectric grease that we're going to put the felt pieces on, and we're going to put the grease on the post on both of them. Then we're going to put our terminal ends back on. Okay, we got the pieces on. And what this grease does, it will uh, help prevent corrosion on your terminal ends. Don't forget to put your cover back on the battery like I almost did. Okay, now we're going to put our battery bracket back on. That one locks in the hole down there. And this one is a little hole right there. Now we're going to tighten it up with our 10 millimeter. Okay, we got our bracket back on. Get it snug. Do not get it so tight that you bust the battery. We'll put our terminal ends back on. And once again, these are 10 millimeters. I don't know if y'all remember from the first video, but this is a 2015, I believe, Honda Civic CRV. Excuse me, not a Civic, dummy. A Honda CRV. Tighten these up. Okay, I fast forward a little bit. I ended up having to take these felt pieces off because this terminal would not go down far enough to tighten up. You want it tight. If it is loose, you will not get a proper connection and the battery will not charge. You will have a dead battery. Okay, take these clips, put it back on, one there, one there. Let's see what we got. We have our key fob. Push our brake. Voila, she cranks. Now all we have to do is reset the radio and time clock and all that stuff. Thank you for watching.